If you're like me, you see so many beautiful and amazing craft supplies, and you're probably overwhelmed by the many choices. Let's face it, as crafters, we pretty much love it all, and it can be hard to decide what is truly a must-have. In this video, we're making the decision process a bit easier for you by breaking down our top 10 card making essentials and sharing why we think these items are useful for any crafter. Let's talk first about the Positively Everything tool. Here at Simon, we're a big fan of multi-use products and our Positively Everything tool is literally the dream tool for all crafters. This silicone pad is versatile in so many ways. I'm telling you, you're gonna reach for this tool every time you craft. We designed the pad with textured surfaces on both sides. These are great aids for many reasons. If you're cleaning your art brushes, the nubby areas are really helpful in getting between the bristles. When you're working with hot tools, such as a heat tool or maybe a hot glue gun, I recommend protecting your work surface by laying the tools on the Positively Everything tool. The silicone material can take the hot temperature safely, and even glue peels right off when dry. The non-skid features of this pad are extremely helpful when ink blending as well. Rest your ink pad on the PET, it frees up your other hand while you're creating, and that makes things so much easier. We have an in-depth video on our YouTube channel that talks about even more ways that you can use this tool. If you haven't seen it already, I encourage you to check it out. There's a link in the top right corner of the screen for you to click on and watch. Speaking of ink blending, we couldn't create a top 10 list without including our Simon Says Stamp blending brushes. These come in sets or as singles, so you have the choice to best fit your crafting style. We designed these brushes with a crafter in mind. There's a brush for every color family in the rainbow, which is helpful if you like working with multiple colors at a time. You'll notice the soft premium hair bristles. This is an extremely valuable feature when it comes to getting a smooth blend. We also created them in both large and small sizes. The larger brushes are ideal for covering large areas or full backgrounds, and the smaller brushes are great for detailed stencil areas, but they're also perfect size for working with our Simon Says Stamp Mini Ink Cubes too. Having high quality, crisp black ink in your creative stash is so important. Our Simon exclusive intense black ink pad is not only archival, non-fading, and acid-free, but it's also fast drying and waterproof. And that means that you can use it with alcohol-based markers and inks, watercolors, pencils, even solvent mediums. You won't have to worry about it bleeding either, which is a really important feature. Like the name suggests, this is a true intense black ink that will give your stamping a beautiful crisp finish. This is the only ink pad I use when I craft, period. Whether you use it as a watermark ink for subtle stamping or as a sticky ink for heat embossing, I guarantee you, you're gonna reach for our exclusive Simon Says Stamp embossing ink pad all the time. The ink dries slowly, which gives you plenty of time to add embossing powder and heat set it with a heat tool. Because this ink is acid free, you also have the peace of mind of knowing that it's going to be safe to use on any project, including scrapbook pages and photos. What makes our embossing ink so special is the fact that our ink pads are extremely moist. And that means you won't have a dry pad for a very long time to come. Good adhesive is one of the most important aspects of paper crafting and card making. Our beautiful dot runner comes in our signature Simon Teal color and has a specially formulated tape inside. The adhesive is initially repositionable, but it becomes permanent after a few minutes of bonding. We also have a pack of dot runner refills available, so you never have to worry about running out of this adhesive. It's very easy to refill. All you have to do is press on the two smiley faces on the top and pull open. Then you can just remove the empty refill cartridge and replace it with a new one. Just like that, you're ready to continue crafting. If you want to learn even more about this dot runner, be sure to check out the video I have linked in the top right corner. It's a great resource. Another adhesive in our Simon family of products is the Craft Tacky Glow. This adhesive is a PVA, which is a non-toxic adhesive that has a lot of great benefits. It's strong on a wide variety of surfaces from all papers to even wood. It's easy to clean up and it's safe for even kids to use. 
Our Slime and Craft Hacky Glue comes in a large bottle and it has a detailed tip, which is perfect for precision placement and control. It's a perfect complement to our dot runner. Having both adhesive types, a tape and a liquid, is important because sometimes you can't always use just one exclusively. Liquid glue like this is great for embellishments, small die cuts, and more. Our Simon Says Stamp Mesh Bags are a simple but versatile organizational tool that makes a huge difference in your craft room. The large 10 by 12 and a half inch size gives you plenty of room for holding many of your favorite craft supplies, including full size eight and a half by 11 sheets of paper. The flexible makeup of this bag also gives room for bulkier items such as jars or tools. The mesh material also has a slick coating, which makes for easy cleanup if you put messier items such as inky brushes inside. Our mesh bags are not just for your craft room, however, these are really great for traveling. You can place your favorite supplies inside and then take them with you for on the go crafty time. Every card needs a base to begin. I think one of the most useful items you could have in your craft room is a stack of pre-scored card bases. We have bright white bases in all of the most popular card sizes available, which include A2 top fold, A2 side fold, both of which are four and a quarter by five and a half, slimline at about three and a half by eight and a half, and mini slimline at three and one eighth by six and a quarter. Each size comes in a pack of 10. While you're creating, simply reach for one of these, fold it in half, and save yourself the time of having to make one from scratch. Speaking of making card bases, that brings us to the next item on our 10 essentials for card makers list, the bone folder. Our assignment exclusive bone folder is made from Teflon, which means that adhesives, inks, and paints will not stick to it. It won't get worn down, discolored, or stained with age. Instead, your bone folder will only get smoother and shinier as time goes on. A bone folder is extremely useful for when you're creasing and scoring paper. If you're scoring paper to fold, you'll want to use the pointed end. When you're ready to crease the paper for a nice crisp edge along the fold, Burnish the bone folder across your cardstock with either the side or the flat end. No matter what project you're working on, it always helps to have a surface to protect your table with. Our Simon Exclusive Grid Mat is large and it gives you plenty of workable space. The whole pad measures 11 by 17 inches. There are 50 sheets in a pad. A single pad can really honestly last you a long time because each sheet can be reused as often as you'd like. This grid pad is the perfect background for stamping and assembling your projects since the grid lines will help you make sure everything is lined up perfectly. The bright white color is also very handy for testing out ink or marker colors before putting them on your project. And because of course it's a paper pad, you can take it with you on the go. Put your crafty project inside of our mesh bag and then slip that along with this grid pad into your travel bag before you head out the door. So we've covered 10 products that we think are super essential for card making and paper crafting in general. I hope that this video has been helpful in narrowing down some of the unique tools and products that are available at Simon Says Stamp. Be sure to check out the full list of supplies down below in the video description if you're interested in anything that I've mentioned here. And don't forget that if you're new to our YouTube channel, we would love to have you be a subscriber. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and also like this video if you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. I will be back very soon with more to share with you all. But until next time, have a very wonderful day. Bye!